hello friends welcome back to another informative video so today we're going to see a common interview question that what is the differences between overcurrent and the short circuit so this question is a very conceptual question and this question has been asked in a very frequent way in the interviews also so i will explain you in a very easy way so that you can be able to understand very easily so Please watch till the end of this video and do subscribe, share this video with your friends as much as possible so that they can also be benefited by this video. So let us start the video without wasting much time guys. Overcurrent and short circuit both indicating that the value of current is more than the required value of the current in the circuit. So now let us see one by one what is overcurrent and what is short circuit. Overcurrent means overload. Let us see with an example. So if the load required current is 20 ampere, let us see the load requiring a current that is 20 ampere. But if the current drawing by the load is above 20 ampere, th then that case is nothing but that is overcurrent or the overload condition. Simply you can see, you can say it as a if any appliances drawing the current beyond the rated capacity, then that is known as the overcurrent or the overload. This is the simple concept of overcurrent or the overload. Then what is short circuit? Short circuit means if any two phases or any leads are sorted together due to any reason, then there is a sudden change in a current in the system. So that is known as short circuit current. That current value is uh, generally very high because if we will sort it two leads or two phases together then that current will be very high so that condition is known as short circuit here you can see in the image also due to short circuit the circuit has been blasted so this is the condition of short circuit